love a good raid. Oh, hi, Shiny. Oh, sh Hello there. What's happening with the stream? Um... Well, first of all, the mouse cursor thing, which is now fixed. Okay. Uh, and I think that's about it. Yeah, it's fixed now, yeah. Yeah, I need to know how to do the stuff with the scoreboard. Oh my... Hold on, I'm just gonna look it up. Uh, he called you. Oh, did he already? Hold on. Yeah. Oh, it's... Shift 1 and Control 1, okay. That makes sense. <laughs> You gonna you gonna li have to leave the voice chat if you wanna like talk. <laughs> you say? Like, or we just <sighs> leave ourselves. Stop the game. Epic game. So can we start over? No, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I'm asking. Yeah. I just I can't start. I'm the host. Yeah, tell me when I am a... Wait, As you I... can all see here, we're very well organized. Yeah, wait, mm -hmm. I need to escape. Professionals, professional gamers, clearly. Yeah. Of course. Boy, just wait a bit, because... They... Okay, never mind, or just go. Uh, okay, we start over, we start over. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's all nil nil. God. So King's Call doesn't count. Fucking hell. I'm hoping that that. Because yes. I don't want to grant Dave. Anyway, how am I gonna do this? Because I can't be in the voice chat, so I'm just gonna move to. I don't know. Yeah. Wait, uh, I know. DJ, do you, do you want to join, uh, uh, join on the casting? DJ's mic is weird, please. Oh, I know Go away. <laughs> DJ's uh, internet connection is very nice. Okay, yeah. and I'm just gonna disconnect. Yeah. I know. Are the fools? Or just mute, whatever, same thing. <sighs> Drink. 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 Can. Big gun. Yes, oh, it's a can. Oh. And Shiny left the my game. The game immediately crashed. G, motherfucking G. So those. <laughs> yeah, I got a victory, guy! <laughs> okay, one. one. <laughs> this is going really well. Yeah, I don't know. Ah, yes, even even in a three seconds game, my APM is still lower than Dave. I feel bad. Uh... <laughs> How I am the only one not in Diamond 3. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Uh, Fair point, to be honest. Port Alexander. All right. So tell me, DJ man, how does one get uh, Twitch Prime? Twitch Prime? Uh, you get Amazon Prime. Yeah. How much money is, is that? It's five, uh, euro. five euro per month. Uh, God damn it. I mean, it's not much, but I still don't want to get it. Why? Right, I'm yes. Back in. Okay, let's restart. Let us redo. Hot Alexander. Why to accept again? Please don't crash this time, thank you. 
Yeah, I hope it doesn't. <laughs> Ah, yes, they versus, okay, nice. I wanna spam in the old chat. Ah, yes, okay. Davis playing both us. Okay. Yeah, ready? Yeah, let's go. Three, two, one, go. Epic. Oh, nice, it actually came off. Alright. Ah, yes, the Kappas, the Kappas. The Kappa is such a good emote. I'm glad they included it in... SD2. Kappa, Kappa's real high quality. Yeah. Of course. No, look, I have ink on my desk. Hi, ink. How do you do? What are you doing? Shaking my ink to answer me. He doesn't want to answer me. I think it's sad. Okay, you can sit back there. Alright, let's go. Or Shiny trying to cast where we are speaking. Right into his sentences. Well, here we go. It finally loaded. Uh, we have... I do not feel bad for that. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, that's how I do that. Ah, yes, it's the plebsman versus the plebsman. Shiny dress. Yes. Um, here we go. Yourself. Okay, so we have. So you don't need <laughs> when it's brother against brother, the world will be different because this is, this that's is, an actual uh... thing. I actually love that fucking quote. All right. Let's... All right. So. Here we have in the in the pink playing Terran we have Bolt, and apparently I just turned my few. That's not what I wanted to do. How do I switch back to? <laughs> okay, um, if anyone knows how I switch back out of player cam, that would be really appreciated because right now I can't see Dave. Press E. Thank you. All right, and then we have Dave playing Zerg. So he seems to be just going for a standard. Both just very standard openings. We got a hatchery coming up first, and barracks coming up first. Nothing too fancy going on, just fairly standard. Not much to say here. Dave is a bit late on his whatever spawning pool gas he's going to go for, but he's just taking it at the same time. Oh well. Barracks is finished, let's see what we're gonna get. And it is, it's a marine. Apparently we don't have game hearts, okay. I asked for it, but apparently we don't need that. Yeah, yeah, I figured it out. There we go, best of seven. Uh, Marine is standing there, not really anywhere where an Overlord is going to be, but oh well. We don't have Zerglings on the way just yet, even though the spawning pool is done. So Dave is just going to drone up hard. Oh, there are the Zerglings. So Command Center is coming up on the high ground. Which is an interesting choice, but it may work out really well, and it looks like there's gonna be some Hellions, judging by this floating factory. But, uh, the score should be 0-0 zero, zero because we restarted. Zerklings are on patrol instead of doing anything useful, so let's see how that's gonna go. And there is no third base coming up just yet for Dave. Just rather curious to see. These making more zerglings that don't do much. The roach warren double gas is going up. Looks like it's gonna be two base roaches. Yep, Lara's coming up. So looks like the Terran will be in for some Aggression here. Nidus, maybe? Mm, maybe. Could be a Nidus, but why would you go Roaches with a Nidus like this? Like, either go on tree base or just go with Lurkers. Okay, we got the Roach Warren finished up. 
No roach in production just yet, but there is a banshee and cloak on the way. So these roaches are going to be able to be cleaned up if they do make it their way to the Terran base. Lair is done, but nothing is being uh, built with it yet, not even roach speed. And there is just a lot of zerglings dancing over here. Meanwhile, on the turn base, we have Hellions also sitting back doing nothing. Six of them by right now. Oh, there's the Nidus. There it is. Looks like we're finally gonna see something happen this game. <laughs> I'm impressed by the amount of nothing that's happening because even the Banshee is just sitting in the base. We've got one Zergling going across. It's the most exciting thing to happen so far. But it's gonna be met with four, six Hellions. Which are both a move command. Well. Hellions are coming in. They're gonna retreat as soon as they see Zerglings, so. They aren't really getting that much damage done here. Banshees coming in from the other side, but there is no detection around for Dave. But this Banshee could potentially deal some damage, but it's at least going to scout the Nidus for him. Yeah, Banshee's picking up drones. I can't see how many because we don't have that modern enabled. Oh, Overseer's being morphed in, so I guess this Banshee is now on a timer. An empty Nidus Worm coming up in the top right of the uh, main of the Terran. Queen going down. And the Banshee is gonna die to the Queens. Nidus Worm is merged. It's not doing anything because it doesn't have units. And here come the Roaches. Are they going to be able to deal enough damage against two siege up tanks? And an SP pool? The answer is definitely no. Checked out for units lost. Yeah, I know that. It's uh, not looking that great for Dave. But I mean, like, if we had, like... Uh, the mod on it would just show on the left how many workers are killed in recent time which is useful this is a lot of hellions uh, there is no armory so it's just hellions those are not very good against roaches uh, we've got a evolution chamber and baneling nest on the way and uh, finally that third base Meanwhile, Terran is still sitting on, well, barely one base. Yeah, exactly. Why no game art? That's also what I was asking. Uh, but yeah, Terran doesn't have that many workers. It's actually They are actually behind in workers, despite not having lost... Yeah, not having lost a single worker. So that's not looking too great there. Yeah, I'll mention it next time. Roaches are just sitting passively in the base. And the Hellions are... Doing Hellion things. But more Roaches on the way and just upgrades and Roaches for Zerg. Finally an armory for Terran and a bunch of just tanks just sitting here. Uh, looks like she's gonna sit back and do a whole bunch of nothing for a while. Which might not be a bad move. Zerg is now suddenly behind in workers with only 28 as more Banshees show up to kill stuff. I must have missed those. And the Banshees successfully kill a bunch more drones and the Queen. And there's no anti-air to actually defend against his Banshee aside from the Spore Crawler which is about to finish. Dave is in a bit of a problem here with uh, not being able to defend against a Banshee. But, I mean, in the meantime, 
Terran isn't really macro. There's no real units being built behind of the behind this banshee. Yeah, exactly. Just casually stacking my minerals. Got a starport with a tech lab going up. Uh, no fusion core or anything. There's still just a bunch of tanks hugging a factory over here. Okay, finally decided they uh, want to move. So it looks like it's just going to be Hellion Banshee tank for now. And a Viking production as well. But yeah, the Terran army is moving out. They're looking pretty threatening with this, this amount of siege tanks. We've got uh, 7 tanks, 20 Hellions against 22 Roaches and 3 Zerglings. So, that queen is dead. Nah, the Hellions are not doing anything, they're just running away. Siege tanks are sieging up right in front of the Roaches, but it's still enough to damage all the Hellions. And we got the third base just going down to a bunch of Hellbats. There's still no anti-air to deal with the Banshees, aside from a single Queen. So these Banshees might be able to just clean up the entire army. Oh, that's the tanks moving in. I wonder how Zerg is going to try to come back from this. Honestly, I don't think they stand much of a chance. Roaches are running to the meat grinder. And that's Dave's entire army gone and it's over. Same. Hello. 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 Did you like the game? That was. Uh, that took a while for something to happen. <laughs> Cyber Forest. Can we get the mod? Can we get the Cyber Forest. game hard mod? For better. For better. Uh, for better what? casting. I enjoyed what that mod. Uh, hold on, let me find the name of it. Uh, it's uh, it's like Game Heart or something. WCS Game Harder. Game Harder, okay. WCS Game Harder. Did you just tell me to Game Harder? There it is, thanks. Now I can actually cast. Now I can actually see when you're building an upgrade. And what units are coming out of the factory without having to click on it. No. It's shiny reading. Don't bully me, Shiny, okay? I'm doing my best. You're doing your best. But thanks, it don't bully me. Except you aren't. I mean, the Banshees were really impressive. I was really impressed by the lack of anti-air. Yeah, David just... <laughs> he killed his own bad. queen with the Rauchi. <laughs> Did he? David I, I just... missed that. Yeah, yeah, he actually killed his own queen with the Rauchi. Like, there was one queen I had like a 5 Ready? HP Ready? 3, bench, 2, 1, was... go. Right. <laughs> Betrayal. <laughs> the Rauchi's <laughs> unionized. The Rauchi's killed a worker union and just... toppled the government. <laughs> Feels bad. Okay, why do I have a gum on my? Oh, hold on. Um, this time we got Dave in pink, and we got Terran Bolt in red, and. Looks like no drones are being produced as of right now, but there is an SCV. Uh, I need to do some stuff, hold on. And who won? Uh, Bolt won. No, that's... Ah, there we go, scoreboard. Yeah, we got a 12 pool coming up, 13-12. Or 12 whatever, I didn't see the details, but it doesn't matter. It's aggression and it's circlings. And it's against a Terran, so we're gonna see how well they can build a wall. This is interesting. Two gases. You usually don't see that. So we got four drones on gas. Oh, roaches. Yeah, that makes sense. I guess roaches would be the way to do this against Terran, yeah. I'm not really familiar with the build myself because I don't like 
super aggressive builds. But yeah. We got roaches coming up then. We're just waiting. Not really much going on for the Terran, like something special. Just standard barracks opening. A very, very quick supply depot. Not entirely sure why that is, but hey. Factory is coming up in a weird angle of the map. I guess it could scout for Nidus Worms if you put it there. Roach Warren is in production now. I don't know if you get a queen with this build, but I know. I don't know. Oh boy. Streamlabs is going ham again. <laughs> Sorry for that. What even got deleted? Hold on. Oh no. Yeah, all caps is a uh, sensitive case for the ball. Anyway, we got these uh, roaches uh, moving out now. Three of them are moving. And there is not much for Terran. There's not actually a single unit out for Terran. Single. Oh, wait, actually, there is. There is one. There's two army supply. Oh, that's a widow mine. That's production, of course, yeah. And I guess this is going to be really tough to hold, because one Widow Miner is not going to kill three Roaches. Widow Mine is uh, sitting up on the ramp, bravely giving its life for a single Roach kill. But will it be enough? Three Ravagers are <laughs> scarily close. And there goes one Ravager. Rip. So I guess he doesn't... There's more Widow Mines in production against this. I mean, if you have enough Widow Mines, eventually you'll kill the Roach, the Ravagers. He doesn't have to actually have enough corrosive of Biles to kill, uh, to kill the buildings. Widow Mines are very... Uh, widow Mines just triggered on an Overlord. So I guess the Ravagers are free to do whatever they want now. These are being pulled off the line, surrounding the Ravagers. I mean, they're going to probably, probably be able to clean this up, I think. Not if that Widow Mine is going to bury right next to them, of course. Okay, I died. Um, well, actually, Boltsto has uh, 13 workers left, has a Liberator out. And Dave is sitting on one base with, like, 14 workers, so this is not actually a really that bad of a spot to be in. If this Liberator moves across the map, Dave is in a lot of trouble. Okay, there are still more Ravagers sitting here. Liberator's hunting an Overlord. And then get Bile. Just barely dodges the Biles. The Liberator's defending. Another Overlord going to be sacrificed to activate some Widow Mines. And, ooh, that's a big mine hit. Okay, Liberator's done for. SCP's being pulled. But the Ravagers are just standing at the door. Supply Depot is down, Ravagers are in. And I... Don't really know what's gonna have to happen now. You know what would have been really helpful to have here? Marines, bunkers. But, I mean, it looks like it's gonna be cleaned up again, unless these Widow Mines kill every single SCV, which they don't. I mean, there's still two roaches left against uh, 10 workers. It doesn't seem very favorable for the workers. Roche is fully surrounded by SCVs, but it's slowly killing them in return. It actually managed to kill almost every single SCV there, 14 of them going down. 
and then it's going to just get its health back by morphing to a Ravager. Hello, the mule. Uh, sitting here. Instead, I missed the Ravager being killed by a Widow Mine because he's looking at the mule. There's a Hero Roach. He's dead now. And here we have the last of the workers being chased down by three Roaches. Very exciting stuff. You know what I'm missing? I'm missing my music. I need to turn it on. Yeah, this game is pretty much over. I mean, there's not really much uh, bolt can produce to get back into this game. But one Widow Mine is not going to do anything but kill friendly fire SCPs. There it is, GG is called. We don't mean. Yeah, Dave, I hope you know that even if you win, you're not gonna do big No. Yeah. Wait, the wrong map. Give me a second, I need to uh, turn on my music. No, map? Do I need to choose a map? Yeah, yeah, choose a map, please. Okay, one second. So, Three, Cyber and Paul and Alexander. Oh, I'm not gonna lobby. Yeah, I no. did. Yeah, I'm Wait, counting I'm choosing down. Wait, I'm I need to think this one through, okay? Uh, year zero. Year zero. Uh, okay. Yes. Uh, alright. Why don't you oh, want to... Davis Road still, Boy. You didn't have to model that all the time. Oh, right. It's fine. Sorry. There we go, thank you. No problemo. Ah, yes. Who is watching the stream? Uh... Why is it always me and Shiny being? Okay, you ready? Uh, Dave, I'm you're Hello. playing Terran. Dave, switch race, Dave. <laughs> okay, okay. Dave, switch race. <laughs> okay, nice. <laughs> oh. oh boy. By the way, th that game would have counted. <laughs> no. By the way, the last game uh, counted high, okay? As my oh, widow wings were very efficient. Wait, you, the last game is gonna be off race. <laughs> no. no. No, please. I know. No. Well, it's one to one. And we're on year zero. Big map, so. Not sure what we're gonna. what to expect here. Considering the aggression we've seen so far. Looks like a standard build of Berserk, standard build of Terran so far. No proxies, no quick pools. There's gas going up. Zerg. Not actually moving to Kateka base. So I guess that one is going to be delayed. Or no, it's just barely in time. Maybe this would be a normal game. Ah, uh, rest of these microphones. <laughs> Got Amon just chilling here, watching the overdose fly by. But so far, there's really anything going on in terms of uh, the shenanigans. Got a spawning pool on the way. Got the uh, hatch. Match going up. And we got a marine first again. So definitely no reapers today. Factory is coming up. He needs an expansion anyway. Reactor being added on. Might just be the same alley and bench tank thing. Oh no, there's a ghost academy being built now. So, and a tech lab on the, there's a tech lab on the barracks. Hmm. Looks like we're gonna see some nukes. But metaproduct boost being stirred up. But no detection for Dave. Is he going to find out about this, re, uh, this uh, ghost academy in time?
Maybe we just got some zerglings on patrol doing not much. And now they're moving out. There is actually a few marines to hold them off, so those won't do any real damage. But it might scout this ghost in production. Aliens are coming up behind this as well, just for some to make it look somewhat normal. But of course there is no expansion. There's also still no nuke in production. We're getting us an armory up this time as well. So we're gonna see some hellbats probably. Considering there's no tech lab on the factory just yet. The Zerglings are guarding the natural expansion of the Terran player. Which would be a good alternative, but then going up the ramp and dying to all of this. But little does they know, there's not going to be a natural, for another little while at least. Another set of the map, we got the Roach Warren up, we got a Lair coming up. So if Bolt doesn't hurry up with his ghosts and actually makes the nuke, I think the effort's going to be a little bit wasted. Don't actually know if the don't actually know if the what you call it, the the ghosts have been scouted. How about ghost? Yeah, I've seen that before. I've actually don't used that before. Personal cloaking is starting up now. And we got the ghosts and hellbats coming out. And what is there to defend? Zerglings and three roaches. Now the zerglings are gonna die to the hellbats and the roaches can just get sniped. Four more roach in production. Roach speed in production. And here comes the Terran army. Got the hellbats morphing in. Got Bane Links on the way, but that's not gonna be in time. Nope, Bane Links getting picked off instantly. Roach is getting roasted. Queen getting sniped. And the snipes land. And that's the entire army going for day. So that is poor because I'm not gonna get roasted by the Hellbats. She chooses to sacrifice them. Yeah, that hurts a lot. Overlord getting sniped as well. Everything seems very dead in the natural. And there's not actually any macro behind this. But this might just be game ending damage right here if these roaches can't clean this up. The snipes are hiding again, roaches are falling. And well, production tab says not that macro. It looks like the Zerg army is once again getting cleaned up. Although the Terran did lose all Hellbats this time. But Ghosts, ghosts uh, still do okay damage. But now they're gone. And it's 19 workers for Zerg against 24 workers for Terran. Which is actually a surprisingly small difference considering what just went on. Still single ghost over here, sniping the lowest health roach. I mean, you can one-shot them, and then go for the high health one. And we've got the, finally the second base coming up. Ah! Ghost screams, yeah. There is indeed no backup plan here. It's just like, okay, let's build another factory, let's build another base. Meanwhile, Dave is happily droning up. Actually getting more workers than Terran this time. So there's nothing much special going on. There's a starport finally coming up. And well there is a bunch of Hellions moving down here. They can morph to Hellbats, so they could be a little scary. But with this amount of roaches, you should be able to defend that, right? 
can come in, could be being cleared. Not the most efficient way to do it, but hey, it works. A bunch of Hellions going the wrong way. Almost getting killed. Yeah, it's about time for a nuke here. It's two spore, uh, spine crawlers are being built. That's an interesting... Uh, where's that other spine crawler? There's one over here? Oh, it's just one. Made to be cancelled. Um, we got just roaches and queens. And on the other side we got banshees and tanks. And a whole bunch of hellions. Now, cloaking is being researched for the banshee this time. But there is no anti-air, so those banshees could do uh, quite some work. Well, there, there are some queens. But that's one queen because everything died to the ghosts. Well, Hellions coming down from the south. Again, hiding in the bushes. And they're pulling back because there's roaches. Yeah, that, those are rocks. You can't go there. If the roaches had chased, those Hellions would have been in a lot of trouble. We've got some tanks sitting here, SCVs being pulled to the natural. But overall, not all that much going on. Tanks are just sieging. Spore Crawler is finally being built now that there is a Banshee in the base. A bit late, but okay. Six drones already went down to the Banshee. Might, might get seven drones. But now the Spore Crawler is here to clean it up. It actually managed to escape. But with the Overseer in the, in the air and all these Queens. It's not really in a good spot there. Might want to move that Banshee. Oh, there's a Nidus Worm coming up now. So it's that time again. Nidus time. It is immediately scouted by the Banshee, which kills another four drones before dying. Yeah, Nidus Worm. And these are a lot of roaches. So this might actually be an effective Nidus. Aliens coming in. Not doing a whole lot. Except for cleaning some creep. And yeah, there is again a lot of minerals for Terran. Should have built some more factories. Okay, that overlord really needed to die. We've got plus one uh, weapons, uh, plus one mech weapons coming up, grand weapons. But, uh, Bunch of tanks, bunch of hellbats. And that might actually shut down the Nidus pretty well. Nidus is done, it's not being used. Roach is just sitting here. So let's see what's gonna happen. Some ravages being morphed in. Still no Nidus worm. I'm waiting. Everyone is waiting. There it is. It's going up in a bit of a strange position. But I suppose he couldn't really get vision anywhere else. Let me check his vision. Yeah, he couldn't really get any vision of the rest of the map. And here come the roaches. The siege tanks are not sieged, so they still have some time to close distance. But they're squashed between Hellions on Moon Command and siege tanks. These roaches are definitely not doing a whole lot of damage here. There we go. Ugh. Ooh. Ooh, that was disgusting to watch. What are the units lost? That's not a button I need to press. Oh, uh, that's also not a button I need to press. Yeah, that's not looking good for Zerg with all the roaches lost. More of the Nidus Worms being grossed. So Zerg has lost a lot of minerals, however, Terran hasn't been mining many minerals. So I guess they're pretty even in that regard. As you can see, Terran is still sitting on 26 workers. Here come the Hellions again. 
This time they're up against uh, Bane Links and Zerg Links, so maybe they will get some damage done with a blue flame almost done. Scan coming in. I really want to move that deep on creep. Not valuing the creep tumors at all as a Terran player. Don't go up a ramp, please. Don't throw those Hellions away. Banshee. Getting drones. The drones go down. We go down. It is very low health. It's gonna get snapped by the queen. It's killed four drones. These Hellions are in a bit of trouble. I'm not gonna get away. Very, very bad. There's a barracks flying here, next to Aemon. Not entirely sure what that idea is about. <laughs> and Terran is just sitting here with a clump of siege tanks that just, just... This is just begging for a swarm host, isn't it? Anyway, Zerg meanwhile is just making roaches. Those will surely count to the siege tanks. And more Hellions and tanks are gonna be moving out this time. So I guess they're either gonna get aggressive or they're gonna defend the expansion. Yeah, it looks like they're getting aggressive. So this might be another meat grinder if these uh, roaches keep up. Get picked off before it deals critical damage to other circlings. Siege tanks are slowly moving forward, and the Hellions are just sitting nicely in front of them to defend. Siege tanks are slowly pushing forward. That Roach has got attacked by his own friends. And we got 24 Zerglings on the way. But will it be enough? Against this many Hellions and few tanks. Yeah, the supply counts aren't very impressive. <laughs> There's a Liberator now. There's a Thor! What is this guy doing here? <laughs> Did he misclick? Did he want mean to make a tank? Why is there a Thor here? 16 minute 1 4 rush. That's a lot of Ling Bane, but is it going to... Ooh. Some Ravagers being morphed in. Hellions keep trying to poke in, but they just can't get the damage in. Meanwhile, an infestation pit is finally in production. So maybe we will see Swarm Host. Oh, there go the Hellbats, they found the button. Liberator being crucified. More tanks are now just sitting at the front door. Could really move these back tanks forward quite a bit. But it looks like the Hellbats are dealing damage as it is. These siege tanks are out of position and will pay for it with their lives. But they do take out a big chunk with, with uh, the other tanks. Hellions in the main roasting everything, but there is not much left there. The natural getting more drones, meanwhile this is just sitting here. Drones and Hellions going down left, right and center, and 21 drones just got killed. Yeah, I think Dave is in a lot of trouble here, being not being able to build anything. Well. Roach is being chased down. I don't think Davis realized his worker count just yet. Siege tanks are still pounding away at the roaches and they go down the meat grinder. Ah, and that's easy. Ah. 
get some fucking. All right, Dave. What map? Which we didn't play already. Mm, King's Cove. Hmm. Didn't we play it from already? Uh, it doesn't count. It All right. Hey, Dave, oh hi, question. Greater U of Xio. Shiny is back. And how do I call you? Like, uh, what's your actual name on Discord? Let me actually check. Whose name? Uh, I, Mr. I ah, yes, right. Mr. Kill. How do you do, Mr. Kill? Mm -hmm. How do you? Fair point. Uh. Add the invite, please. Wait, I did not accept. What? Wait, is someone playing Starcraft right now? Yeah, yeah, it's me against Dave. We're doing a best out of seven for some odd fucking reason. Mm. Yeah, because someone that... apparently thought that making random best of seven gives the winner mod right. By the way, Shiny, Shiny, did you like the last game, Shiny? I liked the lack of Hydralisk. <laughs> yeah, me too. Actually, I'm very, I'm, gl I'm very glad for that. Okay, did ready? you also like my wings okay. of the uh, you guys... uh, build? Yeah, I, I, are you guys, I like how you, are you guys ready? Wait, I want to watch. If it's story. Watch on the yeah. stream. Yeah, watch yeah, on the watch stream. The stream. Uh, yeah, watch on the game's game. Uh, yeah. Dan's <laughs> game. Jesus Christ. What was that sound? <laughs> oh. I, I muted Jesus no, Christ. Meow. No. Okay, Alright, like... 3 to 1, go. Oh god. Okay, looks like we've got King's Cove. Oh boy. Anyway, let me do my uh, scoreboard. No, Dave has one, and you have two. There we go. And. It looks like standard openings because there's no 12 pool happening this time. We'll see where this is gonna go. Looks cool. Overlord's flying across the map. We got uh, an impressive uh, 300 APM out of Dave in these first 50 seconds of the game. There's a barracks coming up here. Nothing going up here just yet. We're waiting for the 17th drone. And there is a hatchery. Hopefully we can see some Hydralisk. Yeah. There's a spawning pool. Factory coming up as usual. And good old Mac openers. Meanwhile, for Zerg, nothing exciting going on. Just standard expansion. Spawning pool in production, which always takes a little while. It's not the quickest build time. And Terran is making an expansion this time. But it's also going for a reactor first. And there is a Reaper being built out of our Tech Lab's barracks. So I don't know what's going on. Factory's blocking that. Okay. Oh yeah, the barracks have to move. So now there's a gap in the wall. Oh, this is a very strange wall. Reactor is being built on the... On the factory. Hmm. Could be Cyclone. I mean, whatever it is, these circlings are not gonna move out to, like, punish it. So I guess this now nah, Reaper's moving out. This is the Terran version of the local wall. A reactor starport. Please don't tell me this is going to be battle cruisers. 
Not now. Not today. Uh, please don't. Meanwhile, the Reaper's been chased around Berserklings. And Zerg is just making a Baneling Nest. And no third base. I don't know what kind of two base, whatever this is. Hey, thanks for the follow. No, you can't give bits because I don't have, uh, what is it, affiliate yet. Who's bad, man? I need to get 50 followers first. And actually stream. <laughs> Hellions are moving out. Banshee's in production. Okay, it's not a battle cruiser. Whew. Another factory being produced. And we got a lair coming up for Zerg. As well as a third base in... On the high ground. I don't know if you usually take it there. No, you can't subscribe either. You can donate though. <coughs> oh, I'm just choking the peanuts. Oh. Okay, we've got Hellions, Fighting Zerklings and Queens. Which is not looking good for the Zerklings and Queens. And behind this, no one is macroing. Manage to proceed to roast things until they eventually die. And 20 Zerglings are being produced as a counter to these few Hellions. Yeah, seize the production, the Hellions are here. Cloak coming up for Banshees, finally. Uh, we got two Widow Mines, a few things. Two more dead Hellions. I don't know. Uh, it's my nice Kappa. There's the Banshee. Not like this. Go to drones down to a bench again because why make preemptive sport brawlers? It's not like there has been benches every single. Oh no! Is there hydras? There is a hydra den. This is huge, guys. We got a hydra den. Also, bending speed. And also, the banshees just moving. I think they finally found the hydra button. Four Hydras in production. Look at them go. They're morphing in. <laughs> Why? <sighs> Where's my emotes? There you go. Aliens versus Zerglings. We got Hydras being built more and more. Even Hydra upgrades. Ooh. It's getting real fancy here. So on the other side, we have siege tanks being produced. Supply blocks being... Oh, wait, no. This is Dave who's supply, supply blocked. And... What is this? This is an armory. Some siege tanks. Not even that much army. Dave actually has a little more supply. But also... Actually, less army supply, just more workers, because why make workers if you can make units, huh? Imagine producing two things at once at once as Terran. That's a lot of drones coming up here for Dave. Anyway, there's even Overlord Speed and Range Attacks coming in, so he's really committing to these Hyperlisk. follow you can indeed into chat what are these hellions doing 
They're just driving around. Sure, into that corner of the map. Bane links being morphed. So just some link bane hydra. There's an infestation pit on the way. Where is it? There it is. Infestation pit. And there are the Hellions roasting everything. Yum. Those Hellions are going to do pretty good against a Hydra as well. Blue Flame is on the way. Hydra Speed is on the way. A lot of Zerglings being built. No. Might actually be going somewhere. Yeah, the queens just died. Now, it's really impressive that they once again do not macro anything as soon as Hellions are moving. Like, Zerg is floating a nice amount of minerals and gas. They even have Larva to spend, so it's not that, like an issue with injects either. Uh, Hellions just go return home. Some siege tanks sitting here. And the Hydra Ling Bane is just moving around. No, also with the map we have some uh <laughs> You'd be surprised what what you can get away with in Diamond League. Uh, Zerglings moving up the ramp, a lot of them, right into a morphing planetary fortress. That's not gonna look pretty when that thing finishes up. Oh, it's cancelled. <laughs> Did you really need to cancel the planetary though? <laughs> it was almost done. And the Hellions were like right there. Got this small ball of uh, in Bane Hydra. Oh, there's a hive apparently that I missed because there is Adreno plants coming up. Anything else using the hive attack? Or is it just for Adreno plants? Yeah, because plus two isn't even on yet. Oh no. I should not come down myself. Siege and Hellions sitting here. Cars are on the move. Going in. Going back out. Oh yeah, because copyright, uh-huh. And the Zerg set a surplus around and kills all the siege tanks. Well, except for these. There goes the Dorito Cannon, not accomplishing a whole lot. And we got some Hellions left over. Two drones somehow went down in that engagement. Meanwhile, neither player is macroing again. Fully focused on their on their battles. Plus three range attacks is on the way. Dorito Glance about to finish up. A Dorito Glance is a long upgrade. Do you need to do anything but sieging and unsieging? There's a Thor sitting here. Oh yeah, no leapfrog. No, not at all. And it's just either all tanks are sieged or none of them are sieged. Yeah, 61 workers versus 44. It's not looking good for Terran. I don't think mules can patch that up. Especially you know, when you double the amount of gas mining. And minerals. Bunch of overlords in there. Let's see, we have, there's a Thor again. I don't know what. Hey, just keep. Why do you just go keep showing up here? Finally getting the limbs. Planetary fortress being made. Is it gonna be cancelled again? Is it? Okay, now this time it'll finish. Boom. It's actually <laughs> this time it's oh it almost fell too. Yep, another random floor. We got the Hellions moving out. Siege tanks are 
they're moving. It's a strange route to take here when you want to attack, but hey, if it works, it works. His army just with a lot of hydras sitting in the middle of the map. That's 35 hydras and like 50 zerglings. That's actually pretty nice. He's almost uh, he's almost maxed, whereas Bap is just sitting at 133 supply. Infestors are being made now. Uh, is there actually? What's the upgrade called? Uh, I don't think there's pathogen glands. Okay, Hellion's going around this way. Two liberators move around that way. These Hellions are just waiting to poke in. Here they go. These Hellions are in trouble. <laughs> One thirty-three supply block by fourteen minutes. Good. Impressive. Okay, the Thor is doing work. It's killing an Overlord. It's not gonna get the kill. Oh, it is. Nice. The Thor did something. Got one kill. It's an Overlord. And we're now just sitting back, floating. Oh, now Dave is maxed out. So I guess he can float. Up is so I supply blocked again. Scans going down, creatures killed. Pathogen glands being researched, burrow, neural parasite coming up next. Lots of Hellions is making a round around the command center. And they're just sitting here. I think they can just move out to kill. Aliens are very scary. Look on the Hellbats. Now some Liberators in the sky. Liberators are in trouble. Something got picked up already. Thanks for sieging. Moving up to the high ground. And we got a lot of Zerglings moving this way, going for the newly constructed base, and that's not going to survive for long. I mean, while the Hellbats are pushing in, getting fungal. Liberators are sieging up way too far from the rest of the army. The Zerglings are returning with our army hotkey, probably. Here come the tanks. But is it enough? Are there enough tanks? There's just so many Hydralis. Yeah, that's GG. Oh boy. Oh, I'm gonna mute this music box. There we go. Yeah, Hello. Yeah, you just met. Hello, Shiny. Hello. Uh, yeah, zero. I got a Tekken Norwegian kicked. Didn't, mm -hmm. didn't we play this one already, Beppo? Yeah, yes, and I want to get it. Yeah, I thought we will do every map for oh, every map? people. Okay, sure, sorry. Like every uh, go for one. Uh, Kairos Junction. Or Kairos. Uh, yeah, raid with mod W. Now we just have to wait for no, wait for the. Uh, As you said, one second, please. One second is like ten years. I want, I want, over. I want to do commentary. <laughs> yeah, no. If. I mean, you can if Tiny agrees to. I mean, it's fine for me if you want to. Oh, I'm not, I'm not gonna break an entry <laughs> at the game as soon as it happens. Wait, why can't I hear my voice at the stream? Uh, because I have my I voice chat on, that's why. <laughs> 200 IQ. 
<laughs> and why is like 15 seconds delayed? Because if they do not come back in two minutes, I get the feeling. Because yes. again, I am not. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm I'm not like partnered or affili affiliate, so I don't have options yet. F. Do you even Twitch, bro? No, I don't. That's a third issue here. Oh, I see Gabriel. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's uh, the Twitch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So hi, Gabe. Hi. Holy shit, this is actually tiring. I are back. Yeah. It's two to two now. I right? can. I yeah. can the game. Why what do I? If? Why do I hit uh, Mr. Kill even though I, he's muted? I don't know. Uh, because he isn't muted. <laughs> I, I'm muted. <using> here. <laughs> oh. Yeah. If you want to see Captain on that. Why is Mr. Kill in uh, game? If you want to see Captain on that claim about uh, complain about stuff, go uh, go into the, into the uh, Twitch chat. It's just a I don't want to see him. Okay, you guys, ready? Three, two, one, go. I can I... into game. Go again. Let me set up my two twos. Game paused. Oh, game's paused. Well, I guess we'll wait. Game resumed. Here we go again with the roaches. It's time again. Yeah, there's a Discord for you. <laughs> nah, the bot is fine. Yeah, I don't know where they are. Yeah, I don't know where they are they're in there. I mean, I'm assuming they're not, like, spoiling the game for each other. Anyway, we got this Roach Warren coming up real quick. So let's see if Bolt has learned anything from the last time. And knows to make units. Other than Widow Mines. Yeah, it is true, but I mean, like, like this is any professional tournament, huh? It's not, uh, not all too serious. And my command center coming up real quick this time. That's gonna be troublesome against these roaches, though. It's done. Roach Warren is up. Yes, yeah, Orbital Command is late. Here come two Marines. I mean, personally, I forget to make Orbital Commands half the time, so I shouldn't be talking about anything there. Okay, we've got a wall coming up, so this might actually be a somewhat successful defense here. There are Marines. Like, the things that are... The things that should be there are there, but a bunker would be helpful. Although then again, they haven't scouted anything, so they don't know these roaches are coming. Well, I mean, not like 
forgetting to make them orbital commands. I mean, like, I make my command sender before I make an orbital command. I could go for expansion before orbital, usually. Here come the overlords. Ready to suicide into the marines. Trying to get some high ground vision for the ravages to buy them. Yeah. I do get the expo earlier. It's nice. Oh, that's one marine down. Two marines. And you know, just... <laughs> Apparently that's enough for Dave to win. No bunker, indeed. We don't build bunkers here. There's a no bunker zone. Map, choose a map. I thought it would be Ah, Cyber Forest, dude. Why don't know the Cyber no, Forest? No, we played it already. No, Automaton, then. No, fucking no. Automaton, where's the thing? Okay, let's go Automaton. <laughs> and so, boom. Automaton, new repugnancy. Those are the two maps left. Yay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Mm. Wait, why am I why am I making you? Why am I always fucking Terran? Because Terran good unit. Yes. Let's go. I'm actually relieved that Mr. Kill left. Oh he he was so tiring I actually. Okay, let's play. Yeah but... You guys ready? Yes. Eight, two, yeah. one, go. Oh boy, here we go again. Wait. <laughs> oh, two more games left. Or only one. Or only this one is the match wins. decider. This is the match decider. Yeah, no Reaper, no Vision, that's very true. And also not being a complete annoying ass. Set up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Macroing with a Reaper on the field. It's probably not gonna happen. Anyway, this time we seem to be getting normal builds because there's an Overlord being produced. Terran, there's the barracks. Critical 40 seconds of GOHFs. Base coming up reserve. Boom. Now what? I don't think they're gonna go for the gold. I hope they don't go for something stupid like the gold base. I really expect better from both of them. No, I've never actually done that. Um, I think I actually have to go in like 15 minutes. But after that maybe I'll, I'll, I'll join. So we got a factory coming up for Terran. Command center coming up. Looks like it's gonna be those Hellions again. Oh, that's pretty cool, yeah. Mining the golden. And the uh, minerals. That's pretty cool. Right, we got a reactor on the factory and I don't know what these tech lab first are by the way. Uh, the link 
game speed coming up. Yeah, I need to go in like 15 minutes. <laughs> I don't th I even think Stim has been researched at all this series. And Cyclones haven't been made either. It's just Siege Tanks, no Cyclones. Who needs that? Um, I would be back, I think, in like 45 minutes from now. But I'll have to see if there's any other plans. There's the starboards. We've got more of uh, the attack locks coming up, so let's see if we're gonna get Banshees again. Yep, there's Banshee Cloak. Meanwhile, on the other side, we don't have a third base, and we have Banelings in a lair. Oh well, we have got three Zerglings, ready to die. Two Hellions. Not that strike would be fun. There's one Queen. And of course, we have three Queens. Banshee is on the way. It's not scouted, there's no detection, Zerglings are having a party up there. And they're- oh, look at that, it's a Hydra then. You learned. We've got Overlords sitting there. The Overlords are nice and spread out, but I don't think they really get any meaningful information here. Unless this Banshee's just gonna bump right into it. Which it apparently is going to do. As you respond now. Yeah. <laughs> wow, it actually bumped right into it. And meanwhile, Hellions on the other side. Expansion is gonna find find an expansion, but just ignore it. Go in to the queen. The aliens are sitting there, not doing contributing to this uh, harass. But if the banshee just kills all the queens, there's not much that can happen. He did scout it, yeah. Actually, did he? Did he see it? He did see it, yeah. <laughs> I mean, there is a spore. But they didn't go up right away as soon as he scouted that. You got hydras in production. Roof spines in production. And just on the other side, there's just Hellions. More and more Hellions. There's a flood in 300 gas. Actually, it's getting out again. Another starport in production. A bunch of Aemons. Muscular Augments being researched now as well, so it looks like we're really committing to the Hydralisk. Sound. Uh, the Banshees are back to be repaired, apparently. SCVs are completely missing them, though. And nothing much is happening anymore. Uh, still 300 APM out of the Zerg. Yeah, they're building fast pace moving units standing at home. <laughs> Yep, if they were to be a bit more aggressive with these. I mean, then again, if they were to be aggressive with them, they wouldn't be producing anything to begin with. That's an overlord down to two Widow Mines. This Orbital Command has a lot of energy. This one as well. I mean, who needs mules when you don't even spend your minerals? 
And here come the Hellions. Oh, they stopped. Is that a bear? Why is there a bear flying here? 38 versus 55 workers. Oof. Big oof. Scan kills one creep tumor. I mean, at least he has plenty of energy for scans. That means going down to Zerglings. Armories in production. That's a lot of Kappas. That's a lot of Kappas. so many kappas. Anyway, we got more units sitting at home doing nothing. Oh, there's a Banshees. Uh, killed two workers, but they did the nice mining time. Now they just die. Zerglings, which somehow don't even get to surround. Why are there four Vikings? Why would you make Vikings? Seriously, you have a reactor. Why is there a reactor starport? I mean, I guess Liberators, but really four Vikings to hunt Overlords. There's a hive in production. So, there's also investors coming up. I don't know about those investors, man. <laughs> this Overlord is gonna get it. The most exciting thing to happen at this point in the game is this Overlord about to get it. Dave has a little supply and a worker advantage. Yeah, this does look a lot like that game. The Vikings missed the Overlord. So he gets to live. I guess Davis is gonna max out and then wait for a counterattack. I mean, you say late game, but it's still just Hydra Link Bane versus, like, Hellion Tank, so I don't know if you can call that late game. I'm just following the Vikings at this point. Pathogen glands and adrenal glands are being researched. So I guess he wants to make those investors. Yeah, there are no mech upgrades. There is just plus one armor. Now, yeah, there's plus one weapons, that's all. Then again, Zerg only has plus one in every category. No, not the overseers. So over here we just have siege tanks, a few liberators. That's a lot of tanks. There's planetary fortress over here. Adreno for unupgraded links, yeah. Then again, well, the links have plus one. The mech has plus zero, has no upgrade, so I guess it works. They still have the upgrade advantage somehow. Woohoo! Worker, worker lead. He's actually getting a worker lead right now. <laughs> Please just nuke, drop a nuke right here. I just want to see a nuke lab right here. That's the only thing I want to know how it happened this game. Okay, here come the Hellions and the Siege Tanks. Liberators, way too far ahead again. Ooh. 
Did the barracks die? I think it did. A lot of scans. Now the tanks are in position. Keep it being cleared up. Cleared up. Somehow Terran has a worker advantage this game. But those Bane links. Oh, the surround. Ooh, this is not looking good for Terran. But somehow they are still cleaning it up with this landed Vikings. Uh, I don't think I can do a game right after this. I think I'm gonna have to go like any second after this game ends. The Vikings killing a hatchery. That's new. Vikings getting friend. Vikings are dying to friendly fire of siege tanks. Is there. I don't think there is a. No, there's no. There is no hive tech except for upgrades. Why would you expect there to be hive tech? You just make a hive to, a hive to make upgrades. That's all. No, no buildings, just upgrades. Are you the servings and well, they clean this up. Let's not use those Vikings. Yeah, Hydrolink Ben against tanks isn't really working. And he's not transitioning out of it either. I mean, to be fair, it took us a while to get from Roaches to Hydrolisk, so... Just one step at a time. Terran is also just making Liberators and Siege Tanks, nothing special. Upgrades being researched. Zerg is actually getting an upgrade advantage now. <laughs> yeah, we want from 12 pool to hatch first, and from Roaches to Hydralisk. Hasn't rebuilt his workers, by the way. He's still just down ten workers. Oh, oops! There goes the bot again. I might just turn it off for caps lock because this is <laughs> this is a bit a bit insane. I mean, the Hellions are not really cleaning up creep that much. But then again, there isn't much creep to clean up. It only, I think it's like 10 or more characters in caps. There is an army moving of siege units and Hellions. Now, if Dave gets a surround, he might have a good chance, but if he doesn't, this is gonna be a really devastating army against what he has. Those are a lot of Banelings. Oh, there go the Liberators. I'm gonna do that, man. By Bane Links. Uh, upgrade tab. I don't know which button that is. I don't know which button the upgrade uh, tab is. Oh, there it is. G. Uh, yeah. We got plus two and. That's all. The use units. Very 
There is indeed no lip branch, there's not even fusion core. That's a queen just killing the liberator from the other side of the gold base. Oof, sorry for the bot being a little bitch. I should really turn off the caps lock thing, because it's, yeah. It's fair to use cap locks. Get back to production, yeah, sorry. Okay, we've got Zerglix. <laughs> we've got Hydralis going down the meat grinder. But they actually clean this up, I want to say. Yeah, they do. But Raven is a bit late. I mean, they don't really produce much when, uh, when there's a battle going on. Siege tanks hitting the hatchery. They completely ignore the Hydra this, but right now they don't. They're already dead. See if I can disable the bot's uh, caps thing right now. Uh, caps protection is now off, so you can spam all you want. Yeah, see, now you can do it. Anyway, there's Hellions killing five drones, and then they die. Dave is sitting at 40 workers right now. I don't know if Dave is using all, ar all army hotkey, but it does look like it. I don't have the default replay interface, so I can't actually check what their hotkeys are, I think. some Hellions. We got smart servos on the way for the Hellions to morph to Hellbats faster. That's new. Oh, there's Liberator range. And a fusion core. How are the units lost looking? Hmm. It's in it's in uh, Bab's favor favor. Quite a bit. That's 316 Zerglings going down. And here comes the army. The four Liberator range. Should probably wait for Liberator range and plus three to finish up, but you know, you can also just go in. Liberator range is gonna finish up in 12 seconds. There we go. All four upgrades synced up. Completely on purpose, of course. Oh no, the Widow Mines. Oh. Here we go. The Liberators are upgraded. But are they going to do anything? Okay, here they come. Yeah, they're just gonna... They're not even using their liberator range, by the way. These these are just sitting like right. You get the upgrade and then you don't make use of it. Well, it's there's why are the liberators sieging right in front of them? You've got liberator range. These are gonna okay. These are actually gonna grab some range. I mean, you can have a choke point with your liberators being a little bit further back, though. Like, if your liberator, your liberators don't have to be in the choke point for the choke point to function. As long as your zones are.
You can actually knock down these rocks and get an opening here. Because the gold has been mined. Oh no, never mind. There's still some minerals right there. Oh, the tanks. Mm. Oh, here comes the Liberator range finally. Now this is slow push begins because... Dave hasn't been rebuilding any workers, by the way. He hasn't made any workers, even though he's making extra bases. So he's just gonna bleed dry on whatever he has right now. One one in the main. Yeah, he's binding over three bases right now. Then again, I think Bolt is has a lot of idle workers. Yeah. Mining. Oof. This hurts. All these, all these workers just do nothing. I don't know if we've got a fight going on. Hey look, the tanks are being leapfrogged. Somewhat. In the meantime, the Liberator is also being flanked, so it doesn't matter. What was that? Was there a hydro disc behind him? I think they just spawned or something. Because he did push himself between the two bases, yeah. <laughs> right, yeah. Can't can't produ can't produce when you're at a battle. Oh no. Sad part is we have to do another game after this, and I can't actually cast it because I gotta go. And Dave GG's. Ah, oh, rip. Yeah, he just didn't say a word any. Hello. Hello. I gotta go now, so I don't know if you when you want to do the last game. Ooh. New repugnancy Yeah, but I can't cast it. Rip. Yeah, I'll we'll just keep the last game as a replay as a game if you want to say it. But no, thank yeah. you for casting the game, Shiny. Let's go, let's go again. Thanks a lot, Shiny. Really uh, appreciate it. Uh, okay. I mean... Yeah, leave the party. Yeah, I need uh, to leave the party. Yeah, yeah. thanks for casting, Shiny. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, see Goodbye. ya.